Yo, what's up, everyone? Let's begin to see here with an another episode of Let's Play Phoenix Wright as Attorney. Yeah, and I've got someone here. No, you don't. Anyway, heavens we are on her. Oh, there, <laughs> there is one thing that bothers me, which is, where is the steel samurai costume now? Um, hmm. Actually, well, we couldn't find it. We're looking so. Hmm. This is the Steel Samurai case. And they were, do, you, do you want to take Edgeworth? Uh. Uh. Faster. Decide. I don't know. Anyway, read it. Just read it. I don't. I don't wanna. No. It's not important. The witness did not did see the Steel Samurai. Yes. And it was clear that the person in the Steel Samurai suit was Mr. Weezy Powers. Hmm. I suppose that's right. Are you? Are you sure? You're sure, Your Honor. Object? Okay, I'm gonna save state. Hold it right there! We keep talking possibilities, but we have to agree that the photo shows a still samurai. Nowhere in this photo can we see Mr. Will Prowers! Hmm. <laughs> the defense has a point. Feel free to say stuff, by the way. I don't oh. wanna interrupt. <laughs> This game is all about speech, so you gotta speak. Also, wonder if someone else no 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 Mr. Hammer, we have to consider the possibility also. Oh, the is mind tap thing. I think the Lami person who has to write this all down is getting really, really confused. Probably. Send allow me to remove the doubt from your honor to your honor. Would the witness continue her testimony, please? No need to ask twice! Earth is that? Um, old bag, Miss Old Bag. <laughs> oh my God! The time of Fort Hammer's death was 2:30. True. The only person I saw go into the studio before then was Will Prowers. No one else went there. If they had, I would have seen them. Um. <laughs> So if no one else went into the studio, uh, then it wouldn't have been the Steel Samurai who did it. <sniffs> Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. Cross-examination. It's like a showdown. <laughs> Pretty much is. Press. How do you know that? Eh, didn't I just explain? I gave donuts to the young detective. And then after some rubbish about being a secret pal, he told me everything. See, Detective Gumshoe shares this fellow officer's fondness for donuts. I really don't get this game. Are you absolutely sure? Voice someone then. Voice old bag, do your, do your best female voice. I don't have a good female voice. Good, that's the point, do it. Look at that little smirk she has. Just just read it. I kind of want to throw a shoe at her. So do I. Just read it. I can't. It's... Read it. Oh, quite, quite, Sonny. <laughs> Nobody's suspicious looking fast by at all. <laughs> Nobody's suspicious looking. Right. <laughs> no one else went to that. Hold it! What about before you got to the guard station? You meant before one. Why, everyone was in the employee area before then. And I locked the main gate so no one could get in. <laughs> Not to mention... It's not even female, come on. I'm trying, okay. If they had... I would have seen them. <laughs> Are you sure? Is it with this sense of the question? I think when going to the studio, you had to pass by the witness. That's right, Sonny. <laughs> Those are her senpai eyes. <laughs> you 
such a puppy. Edgy boy. Ed edgy boy. <laughs> Three edgy boys. Old Wimbag sure has. Well, well, okay. Let's skip that. Or well, you know what I mean. Old Wimbags have a way of skipping over important details after all. Or for that matter, completely forgetting them. How convenient. Something for you to look forward to, perhaps? The time of what happens to us is 2.30. Yeah, it's true. Hold it! How do you know that? This guy has just... Eh, did I just explain? And then, oh, there's whatever. some rubbish. The club. The only person I saw go to the studio before them was Will Powers. Are you absolutely sure? Oh, quite, quite, Sonny. Nobody suspicious looking past by us all. Wait, didn't we do this already? Nobody suspicious looking, right? No, this is different. <coughs> Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> no one holds right there. Hold it! What about before you got to the guard station? Didn't, didn't we do this? Yeah, we did. Go. You mean before one? Okay, yeah, we did this. One earth. <laughs> this is really creepy. What evidence do I have? You see, I haven't played this game in so long, I don't really remember. I haven't played it ever. So I'm just going to save state. Come on, don't give me the little explanation marks. <gasps> yes, I got it. Hold on, look at this photograph one more time. This photo was taken by camera at the gate at studios, correct? Yes, sir, is, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so whenever anyone passes by here, it automatically takes a picture? <laughs> Thought you didn't know we are head from a hole in the ground. <clears throat> right. Anyway. It's also true that the computer at the guard station records all security cam data. Oh, you know. If you wanted to work at the studio, you might have an opening. <laughs> that very computer printed out this photo. Note on the back of this photo printed the words October 15th, 2 o'clock p.m. Photo number 2. 2 o'clock p.m. Oh. You're lying. <laughs> Even I know that it means it was taken at 2 p.m. <clears throat> on October the 15th. Really, Sonny? Actually, I knew that too. The issue here is the bit at the end where it says, Photo number two! Photo number two? The computer only held data for the one photo on that day. Don't you think that's odd? Shouldn't this photo be photo number one? If it was really the only photo? Order! Order! Please tell the court what you mean by this, Mr. Wright. Actually, that's one of why I wanted to ask the witness. The evidence shows that not one, but two people went to the studio that day. Yet there's only data for one of the photos. Who could have erased the data for the other photo? Only someone with access. The security lady herself! <laughs> You're lying. Hey. Hello. Ah, oh, okay. So you had to left, or you had to. Ugh, you had to leave. It's okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, wait, it's not even over. <laughs> you watch your mouth, Whiffer Snipper. The only person I saw that day was Will Powers. But the camera on the gate fired twice. That means two people went by. <laughs> um. Well, yes, that's what it would seem to me. Can the witness explain this to the court? Um, um, I, I don't understand these difficult computer things. Um, edgy boy, help! I'm scared. 
Believe me, I want to, but I don't know what this means either. Hmm? Some help you are. You're whippersnapper too. Whippersnapper? Some of the matter will back. Ah, that's right. I just remembered something. Let me guess. Someone will specify the game. Someone other than Steel Samurai. Are you guys supposed to put it that way? Oh, I see. Your testimony, please. Every day I have to finish my card duties. I have a more important job to do. I go through the photos, record other than a check on them. I throw out any photos that aren't suspicious looking, you see? Come to think of it now, I remember throwing out that one photo that day. <laughs> this is old bags. This is the first I've heard of this. Of course, honey. Only just remembered it. Right, anyway, Mr. Wright, can you please speak to the cross the course of examination? I'll say this is a turn I might expect, but I kind of expected this. <laughs> cross examination. Hey, hey, press. Hold it. Another job. That's right, I check out all the people that passed by the main gate that day. I closely give everyone the photos of the security camera. Do you back my photos of the security camera data? Well, they keep telling me to, yes, but these computers are just so frustrating. Hold it. Hold it. How exactly do you determine what isn't suspicious looking? I can tell by looking at their faces for the most part. <laughs> for the most part. This is a murder trial, Mrs. Oldbag. Well, I didn't touch a special looking little power spotter, did I? I think she's missing the point. <laughs> well, who in the heck was that photo you erased? I'm my fanboy. Fanboy? Still saying my fanboys? Real freaks, if you ask me. They can erase about the wrestles from gosh knows where. Hanging about when was there that day? Wait a second, didn't you just say no one could, else could get in? I locked them in gate so no one else could get in. Those were your words. Well, if you must know, there's a drain that goes into the ploy area. The crate has been loose for a while. It leads outside, and well, that's where they come in. They come in through the drain. I told you they were freaks. Oh, and? And? They're kids, children, whippersnappers. Kids? So on the photo that you erased? It was the boy, probably second or third grade. What? Oh, order, order! So let me get this straight. So two people passed by the gate on the way to the studios that day. One was the steel samurai dragging his leg. The other was a boy who looked to be in about second or third grade. I guess we see his type every day. That was just my controller. Can't stop him, can't catch him. Avoid in second or third grade? Hmm. I assumed it would be hard if not possible for a young boy to wield the samurai spear. Impossible, I think it's quite heavy. Right, as I said, I didn't pay him that much mind. So I erased the data. I'm Nick, what's going on? I mean, the boy was there. It makes him a suspect. Again, they're already trying to unsuspect him. I'd like to take a five minute recess. Send the new information. And never getting vital information this time. <laughs> Mr. WP? Y yes Tell me straight, were you really in your dressing room? You didn't go to the studio. I, I didn't go to the studio, I was sleeping, honest. So who's the steel samurai on that security photo? How should I know? Ah, baby. You see the other guy was recording in the dressing room. And we could have walked in and taken it, really. What? You should take better care of that stuff. <laughs> I couldn't imagine anyone who would want the steel samurai costume. So where does this leave me? It doesn't look good. You're the most likely slipstick right now. Nick, what, what are we gonna do? First, play uh, for more time. We'll start targeting someone else that could have conceivably done this. Right. It'll take them so long to shoot us down that we get another day. Right, but if we pick the wrong person, we might lose on the spot. You don't sound very optimistic. I'm not optimistic at all, actually. Hey, Nick, it's time. Okay, go. 
Oh, I'm really sleepy. What does that mean? Please don't start like that. <laughs> Cool, now we can reconvene with the fires of Mr. Lubars. And that's where I leave off, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you give this video a like. If you enjoyed, leave a comment in the comment section down below. And subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my content. Make sure to share this video on Google+. Yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.